Hello everybody, I'm back again. Just wanted to do a quick video to share this book that I just finished, well journal that I just finished. Um, it is, I think it's five and a half by eight, if I'm not mistaken. And this one didn't come out so chunky, but it's still a little chunky one. This is the back. Um, the cover is a soft cover. I think I used a paper bag. I think. And this is the inside. So on the front here, we have a, a book page pocket. And I just have these two pieces of ephemera. And then on the back, just a bingo card and a tag. And then I have this beautiful image and I left her open in the back so she has a, a layaway tag and it's blank. And um, on all the images that I have in here, I, they're all open in the back and they all have a journaling um, layaway tag for extra journaling space. So my next page is this one here. Make sure I'm in frame. Another little cute book page pocket with these two pieces of ephemera. This is from Tsunami Rose and this is from a paper collection. Those tucked there. And then I have this one here, also from Tsunami Rose. And then I have a doily here, and these came from A Tattered Dreams on Etsy. And, um, 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 um Practice Make Pretty, is, she's on YouTube. So if anybody's interested, she has a lot of fun, good stuff in her store that you guys want to check out. These are the oval doilies. And then I found this little piece on um, Pinterest, and I left it open, so... It can be used as a as a tuck. And then here I have a little card tag. I mean, this one came from a paper collection as well. And I left it open and inserted these two. This is just extra paper that I just uh, cut out to size. And this is a journaling card. And then on this side, I have a little corner pocket, and I just went ahead and did some layering with some uh, some scrap papers, and then just inserted this cute little um, digital um, image that I shrunk. Jesus, I can't remember her name. I'll have to look it up and put it down on the notes. But I, I got that from Etsy. This is from Tsunami Rose. And they're all backed on, on book pages. All the ephemera. This is extra uh, paper from a paper collection. Here's another image from Tsunami Rose. <clears throat> and then here, I just added this cute little image. And I backed it just with some uh, book page and a piece of this like paper bag. Of course, some stamping. My butterflies, of course. Here's just one of these pockets. This is just held by a paper clip, so it could be removed for journaling space. And the pocket is a book page pocket, and it just has these two images, and they both came from Tsunami Rose. This is one of her ephemera kits. And then on this side, I have these two. Uh, another piece of ephemera, which by the way I forgot to say they're all sewn uh, on book pages and um, yeah, I just sewed around them. And this is from a um, paper pack. Okay, it's not cooperating. Come on, come on. There it is. 
Then on this side, I have another little book page pocket. And I just added this piece here, some fabric, eyelash trim, and then I just added these two pieces. This is from Prima and this is from a paper collection. I like this one. That's the little, um, I don't want to say glitter, but it's not glitter. And just pop those in there. And then these two pieces of ephemera, both from Tsunami Rose. And then on this side, I have another beautiful image. She also has a layaway tag in the back. And here I just did some stamping. I just added some of that um, uh, brown paper that I got from... Um, God. Brown paper. <laughs> and I just stamped Paris and just did some layering there with some fabric and lace. And then a little journaling card from a paper collection. On the middle pocket, we just have these two pieces from Tsunami Rose. And then I have one of these large ticket tags from Artie Base. On this side, I just went ahead and did some layering of papers. This piece here came from a paper collection. So I just grabbed some uh, book page, and then this is a piece of, uh, actually it was from a book page as well. I just sewed it together to make a little tuck, so I thought that was cute, easy. And then this one came from a paper collection. And then this is another style of doily, also from um, A Tattered Dream on Etsy. It's embossed with a little rose. And then here I just have these two pieces. Tsunami Rose and this is from the paper collection. And again I put some of that brown paper and did some stamping. I've been trying to decorate my pockets where you know they're they won't be so bulky so I don't create these humongous books <laughs> that I do all the time. On the back here I have this image and I got this from Pinterest. And I just backed it on, uh, this is also came from a book page. So I thought I'd use it as a background to these images. Space for journaling here, I just did some stamping on the bottom. Here again I did some more layering of some scraps and then just added this little bird, uh, well, bee card that came from a paper collection. And then inside the pocket, another journaling card and this was from Pinterest I think this one was backed on wallpaper and then on the back I just went ahead and did a tag and this was um, brown uh, cardstock I guess cardboard cardboard car cardboard look sorry guys you guys know me I have issues some stamping there another pocket did some layering and some stamping here is another journaling card from a paper collection and then a small little tag and I'm not sure what this this um, tag came from but I backed it on some book page I'm trying to say it's from a kit that that I purchased on Etsy here I have a corner pocket and I just did some layering, little flower and this also came from a paper collection and then I have some uh, a book, little notebook I took apart and just added one of the pages here just added that piece there and here I did some stamping then this is uh, one of my pockets that hang over the top I did a little bit of, um, added this little piece, added some flowers, and this image came from Pinterest. And then this is the other side of that pocket. And then here I have this little tag that came from a paper collection. This I think came from uh, Pinterest. 
And I think this one came from Pinterest too. And this one's back on a piece of wallpaper. And then another little piece there. This came from Pinterest, a little flower. This side I have another ticket. I found these on Pinterest. It was a freebie. And I think they, they it came from Tsunami Rose, which I've never seen them, but I found them on Pinterest as a freebie. So I printed those out. Here I have another beautiful image. Then here I just, on this paper, I just went ahead and added some lace. Just for decoration. Here, another piece of, uh, of um, lace, little button with the bow, just to decorate the page. Here I have a corner pocket, and I did some stamping, and just collage some scraps of paper that I had. This little piece came from Pinterest. And then on the inside, I have this one from Pinterest, uh, no, Tsunami Rose. Actually, both of these, I think, are from Tsunami Rose. Little postcard. And it's back down wallpaper. Here I just put a little piece of fabric at the top to decorate it. And here I have another little pocket. And I have this cute little tag that came from a paper collection. And I think this came from Tsunami Rose. And then on the back, these, this actually was a piece that was gifted to me from Wally over on uh, Facebook. And I just made copies of it. It's very fine, the paper, very like thin paper. Like I, I, um, I made copies of it. I feel like it's going to tear, so I have that put away for me. And then here's the journal and card, I'm sorry, postcard. Back down some wallpaper. I love putting the wallpaper. I think it looks so cool in the back. Here I have one of these little um oh my goodness. I have this here. <laughs> I am so bad guys. But yeah, so I glued her in just on the side so I can use it as a tuck. And then I have this journaling card from uh, one of the paper collections I have. Another book page pocket here. A little bit of uh, collaging with some scraps. Added some uh, fabric, some lace, little flower. And then uh, inside the pocket I have these two. This one I made from some, uh, I used a digital kit I purchased on Etsy and just made a bunch of tags and and uh, use that. I thought that that was cute. And they're backed on uh, a file folder. And this one I think came from Pinterest. And then on the back, it's one of the. Um, this one also came with that digital kit I purchased. I think it's GT Designs, if I'm not mistaken, where I purchased this kit, just different pieces of ephemera. That goes there. Here I just added that little piece to decorate the page. Here is another doily and I just went ahead and added this piece there, cut it in half, put the other half on the back of the doily and I left this one open to just insert this cute little tag there. I figure I could use that as a tuck. And then, oh wait, my little setup here is moving. And then on here I have another one of these tag pockets that it's just held by a paper clip. And I just have this little journaling card that came from Tsunami Rose. A little tag I made. And a postcard from Tsunami Rose. Those just up there. Then on this side, I have another piece of ephemera that came from Tsunami Rose. And this tag came from a paper collection, and they're just held by a paper clip. 
so you have a lot of space for journaling. Then on this side, I have another one of my little pockets. Just added this little piece here that came from uh, Pinterest. A little flower, and this, on the inside is just a little tag I made. And then on the back, I found this piece, by the way, um, I don't know how long ago I had printed it, never used it, so I popped it in there. And then these two, this is from a paper collection. This was a freebie on uh, Pinterest. And I just stamped a little, a little um, typewriter on the back. So those go there. Here I have another image. And she also has a layaway tag on the back. Then I have this little pocket here that again I did some layering. This is just a piece of scraps. Pieces of fabric, little flower, a little journaling card from a paper collection. This is also from that digital kit that I purchased on Etsy. And then here, this also from uh, Pinterest. Um, I just uh, I was going to glue it down. At the end, I ended up leaving part of it. Um, open so I could just it could just be used as a tuck and I made this little tag so I thought I a popper in there then here just a little corner pocket which is some fabric and lace and it's holding this image and this these images are from Pinterest and I put them printed that I printed them out on photo paper <laughs> telling you I don't know what's up with me another little corner pocket or tuck but I put this time on the top and it's holding this journaling card from Prima and this one's from Prima as well so those just pop there here I have one of those little envelopes that I used on my um, my TNs from my last video I made. Just a little envelope that I made with um, I'm not sure if it was the dictionary or um, yeah, I think it was a dictionary that I used. And then I just put that image in front and these came from Tsunami Rose. And it's just holding by a paper clip so you can hide some goodies in there. Then on this side, I just added this bingo card, and then I did a little stamping on the back, added a book page, and I think this one came from Pinterest, or was that from that kit? I can't remember, but that just pops there. Here's the other side of that doily, and here's another, right this way. Just added that little piece, some fabric on the bottom, little flower. And then in the front, I just have these. These were gifted to me. They're from uh, Graphic 45. So I popped one in there. These images came from Tsunami Rose. And they're backed on, um, on wallpaper. And then this one's from Tsunami Rose as well. Also has wallpaper. And then on the middle pocket, I just have another little uh, postcard from Tsunami Rose. And I think that's from her Jane Austen kit. And this is a tag I made. And this one's on a file folder. And then on the back I have this beautiful image. She also has a layaway tag in the back. And then the back pocket has this journaling card and I think this came from Tsunami Rose. This came from one of the kits, a uh, book, book page, uh, paper, paper pad collection. And this one here. And then on the very back, I had this journaling card but it said something in the back I can't remember so I just put, um, I just covered it up. I forgot what it said in the back but it, you know, had nothing to do with vintage so 
sucker got covered. <laughs> but I love this side because, you know, you can journal. So that's what I did to that one. Actually, I think I have the blue sticking up. But this is it, guys. This is my latest journal. Um, I'm working on another set of TNs. Um, those will be coming up soon. But I had this one. It was partially finished. So I'm like, okay, I need to fix it. Fix it. Finish it and get it out of the way. So in the front, you just have uh, this. These little flowers came from an applique. And then uh, these little flowers I got on eBay. And has a little pearl in the front. And then I have her there. So yeah, I like how that came out. I think that looks so pretty. But yes, this will be listed on my Etsy store if anybody's interested. Thank you so much for stopping by, guys. You guys have an amazing rest of the day. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care and God bless. Bye-bye.